Let's see how much we're in right now. I'm low-key nervous, bruh. Bro, did I break the f***ing scale? Like, my fat, it's too, I'm too big, bruh. I can't even. So today's seven day challenge, I thought it would be cool to start the new year off with a little tiny resolution and that is to eat healthy and to see what eating healthy can really do for not only my weight but also my health, my mindset and all that kind of stuff. In this video, I show the full seven days every day, what I'm eating, how I'm feeling, is it affecting me, is it not affecting me? So if you guys are excited for that, don't forget to go down, hit that subscribe button, leave a like and enjoy the rest of this seven day challenge okay i hope everyone had a good christmas a good holidays all that good stuff honestly i did it was chill we were kicking it i don't even know like i usually don't like christmas time this year it did i don't know why i'm like a Scrooge or something with this Christmas. I feel like I literally gained like 20 pounds Like I don't know how much weight I gained. I just know I just know that I was eating like horrible food the entire like I'm not kidding for example yesterday It's not even the holidays anymore. It's a t it was a 29th yesterday yesterday what I ate like just guess what I ate for dinner, bro I had like four dinners yesterday like I swear on my life like I went downstairs ate one of those fucking truffle Linendorf things bro the fucking the fire ones like I feel like I just I got a double triple chin from this a piece of cheesecake Doritos cheese and crackers bro and I wasn't done there I then went back down an hour later ate more chocolate had some fucking graham crackers and milk like what am I five like, I swear I'm five bro I don't I don't know another piece of cheesecake my mindset through all of this is like yo if you just eat all of the junk food in the house you won't have to eat it this week <laughs> So I literally had like half a cheesecake yesterday, 10 chocolates, bro, a thing of graham crackers, finished off the bag of Doritos, and that was just for dinner. And that was just one day, bro. I don't know how much weight I've gained, bro. I really don't. Oh my, yo, I've literally gained like, I've literally almost gained 10 pounds. Holy shit. Get the fuck away from me. Not only am I concerned about like how much weight I've gained, I'm also concerned about just the habits that go along with eating really shitty food. Like I have never been so thankful for a week to be over. Cause like bro, Christmas was on Tuesday and that means that it just lasts a whole fucking, bro. It just was, I'm so happy it's Monday and this whole, we still have New Year's which is, Holy shit, bro. The fact of the matter is that throughout this week, I have gotten some pretty shitty habits. I'm not gonna lie. One, my face just feels swole. Like, I feel swollen, bro. Like, I feel like a fucking balloon. I'm breaking out. Also, I just am sleeping in longer. And right now, I feel like I just woke up, but I feel tired. Like, before Christmas, I was eating really healthy, drinking a lot of water. That's one thing that we need to focus on this week. But before that, I was waking up early. I was really refreshed in the morning. I was motivated. And then, eating like shit this whole week i've just felt depressed waking up bro not in the mood to get shit done i've been in the mood to sleep and eat chocolate bro like that's really been the vibe so we need to switch that around so we're gonna be eating healthy for an entire week and seeing what that does for us bro like i don't know is it gonna make me stop scratching my face like this is it gonna like i feel like 300 fucking pounds right now i'm not I'm not kidding. While I'm talking to you guys right now, I'm like, holy shit, my face is weighing me down. Like, I just, bro. Let's get this week up. I'm excited. Unlike a lot of people where they're, like, dreading eating, I am so excited, bro. I just feel like a fat fuck. Like, I feel like 500 fucking pounds, bro. I just really want to get this weight off. Maybe we'll go to the gym, too, in this. Like, I don't really know what this series is going to bring us, but it's going to be interesting. First, we need some coffee, for sure. These mother are the damn culprit actually these ones are kind of gross which I'm ha I bought my mom these for Christmas and like she's not even gonna eat them I'm probably gonna eat them I'm happy that I bought them because they're disgusting they're like eggnog peppermint and then pumpkin spice like disgusting y'all thought I was lying about the cheesecake we need coffee I think that's like the biggest thing there better be Let's get this healthy food on the road. I just, oh, I feel so nasty right now. I don't know if you guys feel the same way of when you just know you've been eating like shit for a long time. And then you go and you just feel disgust. My face feels fucking pregnant. 
Okay, I know you guys can barely see me because I don't have my tripod because that shit broken, so I'm using a box of <laughs> We have eggs. I feel like the only thing I really want to do this week is obviously eat healthy. Two, cut out like all carbs, bro. Like, fuck all that. Cut out a lot of sugar. Drink a shit ton of water. Because water is honestly one of like the most... Like, people really sleep on water. And like, I know it sounds like a joke, but water is like crack, bro. Shit will make you go insane, bro. It will make you focus. At least, minimum, I want to drink 15 water bottles a day. We got this chicken and rice. I'm gonna keep scared. I have not eaten my own chicken and rice in like years, bro. Cause last time when I used to make this shit all the time, it would always come out rubbery, bro. Bro, like the chicken be tasting rubbery, bro. Like I don't understand, bro. Why is it? Like I literally cook this bitch, steam this whole like, bro. It would be like, I want my chicken to be like moist. No, like I want my chicken to be burnt as fuck so it's not chewy at all like at the end of each day we'll add up like calories and like what we be eating a lot just so you guys can know if you want to do this i don't even know bro because i have no idea what the fuck i'm doing i'm just eating like what i think is healthy like what can i do to make this bit better bro are beans healthy maybe we'll get some beans for tomorrow like when you go from eating like shit because like i was just eating healthy bro and it's like this shit would fill me up to the max but like when you're eating like shit for a minute, you get hungry quick, bro. You, you could just keep shoveling food in your mouth. I could eat like anything right now. I'm like talking about food while I'm eating food. Like that's how hungry I am. Mm. Mm. All right, I'm gonna eat this in dip. Here. So uh, for dinner, I forgot to, to record. But if you guys were wondering, I had some ground beef, some rice, and then some yogurt. And we're gonna go over that in the next clip and add everything up for the day, like all the calories, all that stuff, how I'm feeling, like what the vibe is like. Am I hungry? Am I starving? Um, I'm gonna go over all of that right now. So it's 12 o'clock now. Um, I already ate dinner. I ate some ground turkey and some rice and a yogurt. I didn't really feel like recording because I'm not gonna cap, bro. I was mad as fuck, like, because I was so hungry because I didn't eat till, like, eight, and I was just starving, bro, and I was like, I just need to eat this food, bro. I can't be, like, recording. Sorry, I'm, like, whispering, but it's just really late. I'm gonna add up the calories. For breakfast, we had three eggs, which is 234 calories, and for lunch, we had one chicken breast. Eight hundred and ninety-nine calories. The average woman needs to eat about two thousand calories per day to maintain, and fifteen cal calories per day to lose one pound per week. Whoa. Okay. So it says the average man needs to lose twenty-five needs twenty-five hundred calories to maintain, and two thousand to lose one pound of weight per week. Is it safe to eat twelve thousand twelve hundred calories? Eat fewer calories than you burn, and your body can resort to burning your fat. I don't even know. It says it's not healthy to eat only 900 calories a day, but like, whatever, bro. We're eating fucking healthy. Like, get off my dick. I'll see you tomorrow for day two. It's honestly, like, not even that bad. I just want to see if we, like, lose weight, bro. Not gonna cap. <laughs> Yo, what's poppin'? Day two. It's gonna be pretty basic. Like, we're just gonna eat the same thing. Not even gonna lie. Like, that's why this shit's so boring. It's like, you're just eating the same thing every single day. But, like, my mood yesterday was shit. With, like, horrible waking up, bro. I couldn't get out of bed. Like, it just was, like, one of those, like, groggy-ass days. You feel me? Today, dude, I woke up at, like, four in the fucking morning and couldn't go back to sleep. Like, it was one of those days when you wake up and your mind is just racing. But regardless, I was up in the morning, I was ready to get shit done, you feel me? And now I'm eating breakfast, but like, my mood was 5 million times better than it was yesterday. Like, I wanted to like, get my work done immediately this morning. Yesterday it was like, fuck this shit, I don't want to do anything, I don't know. Just drop the shell in my eggs. I just want to lay down and not fucking do my shit. I don't know, it was like weird, bro. I feel like that, like, I dropped another shell in my eggs, bro. The difference was honestly so noticeable, like, I'm not even gonna cap, like, it really was. I'm gonna eat this because I'm actually starving right now. I really feel like, is it just me? Like, I don't know why. I feel like I'm the type of person that eat healthy for one day and I'm like, I lost like hella weight. Like, I look fucking way better. Like, it's weird. I don't know. Maybe that's just me or maybe it's everyone. Like, 
I picked the worst week to do this. It's like the worst and best week to do this, to be honest. Because, yo, like, fucking New Year's is today. I don't know how that's gonna work, bro. I'm probably gonna get drunk as fuck. And when that happens, you can't eat healthy, bro, when you're hammered. You can't. I don't know who. That's like a superpower. If you can do that, then you are defying odds. You need to run for president. Like, you need to do something because you have, like, you have something that, that most people don't, bro. You have the will to not eat like shit when you are drunk as fuck. And I'm not eating a lot, so it's like I'm gonna get drunk as fuck. Which is, it's just not good, bro. It's not a vibe. Like, we just have to figure that out. <sighs> so, I'm extremely nervous for tonight. Tonight is New Year's Eve. It's 5 o'clock right now, and all I've eaten today was freaking eggs, bro. Like, that's literally the only thing I've eaten. I need to get some carbs in my system ASAP. I'm not trolling, bro. Or else I will black the fuck out. I just want to record right now just because I don't know if I'm going to record after, like, tonight. I don't know, bro. I don't really know what the plan is. I This is the weirdest New Year's Eve ever, and I know, like, that's not the point of this video, but, like, it's involving this week process. So I'm just going to talk about it, you feel me? Anyway, every New Year's Eve, I have plans. I've never not had plans. This year is different. I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing. It's kind of sad, not going to lie, that I don't know what the fuck I'm doing because everyone knows what the fuck they're doing on New Year's Eve. And I'm just sitting here alone wondering, am I going to go out? Am I going to drink? Am I going to stay home and do absolutely nothing? Who knows? I don't know. I just thought I'd share that because that's what's going through my mind right now. As I make this ground turkey, I'm probably still gonna black out because this is not enough food. This is like a blackout diet. I'm not trolling. Like if you wanna be able to if you wanna drink a beer when you go out and black the fuck out, eat this, bro. Like if you wanna save money on alcohol, eat this. Cause I already know I'm going to drink one beer and be like, I'm drunk as fuck. And I know I sound like a lightweight bitch, but that's just facts, bro. I need to watch what I'm drinking tonight. This is gonna be so bad. So so bad. Got steak with some rice and some, uh, what is it, what's the green, broccoli? Guys, I'm way too hungover to film right now, so if this today is, like, really, you know, not a vibe, it's because yesterday was New Year's. Not even gonna lie to you guys, um, surprisingly, I thought yesterday that I was, um, gonna slip up a lot. And eat really bad. I didn't really eat anything. It was more an alcohol diet last night. Didn't black out, but I puked this morning. Oh, I also had bacon and eggs this morning, so I'll add that in there. Sorry, this kind of doing this week long video in the middle of like Christmas and New Year's is very, it's kind of hard to do, but whatever. I'm eating steak and rice hungover as hell. You know how good a McDonald's breakfast burrito and hash browns sound right now? Do you realize I could just go drive my ass to McDonald's, eat that shit, and then just fake eating this? I could do that, but I'm not, you feel me? That's all I have to really say. I'm done now. I just recorded myself for 10 minutes eating, not talking. Uh, see you at dinner. So, since I have a really hard time um, recording when I'm supposed to, we're gonna break down days two and three and let you guys know what the calories were for those two days. So for day two, I had eggs for breakfast, three eggs, that was 234 calories. For dinner, I skipped lunch that day. Um, I had ground turkey, which is 220 calories, and then I had a potato, which surprisingly is 163 calories like how the fuck is a potato 163 calories so if you add up breakfast and dinner 234 plus 383 that is 617 calories for day two plus alcohol so we'll add in about 200 calories i wasn't drinking soda it was a strict I don't know, I forgot what I was drinking, but we'll just add in 200 calories. Moving on to day three, I had some bacon and eggs in the morning. I only could eat one piece of bacon, plus 
three eggs is 234 calories making 270 70, making it 277 what the fuck is wrong making it 277 calories for breakfast and then for lunch i had some steak and rice the rice was 206 calories the steak apparently a, a steak is 679 calories which doesn't make any sense which would equal to 885 calories but it was a really small steak so we're gonna cut it in half which means we had 585 calories for lunch and then moving on to the night time i got a little hangover hungry craving so i had to go downstairs eat some cheese and crackers which uh cost us 200 calories at night and then adding everything up bre breakfast lunch and then our late night snack i know what you're saying where it was dinner i didn't eat dinner because i slept the rest of the day that that day uh, making our total calories 1062 for day three which is our most calories that we had out of all days. Anyways, back to the video. I'm gonna try adding Frank's red hot sauce to spice this be up a little bit. You're, ooh, that's good. I feel like we just been doing the same thing for three days, bro. See what the vibe is looking like with these things though, okay. Mmm, <sighs> with the Frank's red hot, the salami, you're, Bro, food just slaps, bro. Like, I swear to God, I could just eat for hours. Like, it's so sad that I'm coming to my last bite. It's like, and then I can't eat for like another hour. Or, no, hour. Like, three, four hours. Mmm, that shit went fire. Holy. Okay. Ooh, got some chicken. This is our dinner right here. For lunch, I just ate an apple, and that was that. I know like an apple is not ideal for, I don't know. Chicken and rice with some onion, bro. Mm-hmm. Here. Dude, like every meal is just like, skirt. Like, let me eat, bro. I'm really hungry all day. And then when I get to eat, it's like, here. Like vibes increase. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mmm. 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 Like not <sighs> so much different. Oh my god. With the onions and the seasoning. Mm -mm. The fuck, bro. Gordon Ramsay. Who are you? I don't know who you are, bro. I've never heard of your name. The perfectly cooked chicken. Yurt. And then the nice rice, bro. Perfectly cooked. Everything. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. This shit goes hard. I could eat this every day. It's just really spicy. God damn. You guys know the vibe. Um, we're just eating eggs. Literally just eggs with one piece of salami and Frank's Red Hot. I mean, it'd still be fire though, not even a cat. Like, what's up? Red Hot? Mmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. I'm so sorry, Rocky, but like, I'm sorry. Wow, well, that you just look so sad right there. So it is now dinner time. For lunch, I have ground beef with rice and an apple. I have ground beef and one egg in this thing. Um, I literally have not showered yesterday. My like focus. And creativity has been like to the max, bro. I'm not even trolling. I don't know if it's because like eating healthy, like you get that feel in the morning, like you get the good food. I don't even know. Like I have no idea what I'm talking about. All I know is like I just worked for a fat amount of time straight, and we just was creative the entire time. Like did not get bored. Usually, like I need a break from editing and shit, but like today I was like, bro, I can go for hours. Like I could go for like ten more hours. I swear. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Anyways, I'll catch you guys tomorrow for day six. In the morning, maybe we'll switch it up and try something, like get some food, uh, get like a different breakfast going, I don't know, because I know it's been boring and the same thing every single day now, I don't even know, bruh, so we'll see tomorrow morning, because it's Saturday, you're, okay, so I said I was going to make something different, and I made the exact same thing, honestly, just because it's like, I don't want to waste like breakfast on something that I don't know that's going to taste good, you feel me, especially when it's like, I know I'm going to be hungry for the rest of the day, you got me fucked up if I'm about to eat something that's, <coughs> that's not going to fill me up, so like, I'm just hungry, and I want something quick, like, 
I honestly just want this week to be over. Just because like it's hard being hungry all the time, bro. Like I just want to eat food, bro. Like after this is all over, I'll probably still eat like the same stuff every day, but like being able to like eat something fire like once in a while, you feel me? Like I've only been eating meals, like small ones at that, bro. And it's just like, what do you mean? Like why am I starving all day? Like last night, I literally wanted to go get McDonald's so bad. I was like, I was so close. We only got a couple more days left. Let's just run it out. Let's just see what the vibe is like and leave it at that. She's like, I'm still starving, like. We are switching it up. One, this is probably extremely repetitive for you guys, and it's extremely repetitive for myself as well. I don't want to eat ground beef. Like, I just don't, you feel me? Um, obviously we have to stick to a low diet, like low calories. So I'm thinking we get some sushi, some veg. like I don't eat regular sushi, like I just can't, I've never had it before, but like I love fucking like the veggie sushi, bro, the cucumber, so like I'm a pick. Ooh, I'm excited, bro. I'm like a fat fuck, bro. I'm just so excited to get this sushi, and like, it's just gonna be like a different. We're switching it up. I'm excited, bro. I'm excited. You're, 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 you're. I'm excited. That was hella weird. Okay, I'll see you at home. Girl, yo. I thought that we were only gonna be able to eat like half of this, bro. There's, hold up, let me open this bit, bro. We have 12 pieces of fucking sushi in this bitch. One pack only has 330 calories, bro. Like, I'm so hyped up to eat this shit right now. Like, I'm not even trolling. Oh. Mmm. Mm. I don't know what's in this hoe. Let me like. There's a California roll. I, I don't know what's in it. There's just veggies and shit. Like, there's no fish because that shit's disgusting. Especially buying it from Pick and Save. Like, six dollars and fifty cents for twelve pieces of sushi, bro. Like, that's like fifty cents a piece. Dude, I don't even need to eat this. Like, I'm already full as hell. I don't remember exactly what what weight I was at the beginning of this, but obviously I'll pop it up on the screen. Hold on, let me put some fucking clothes on and then give my final thoughts on all this. Whew. Okay, um, I'm gonna go over everything now the entire week. I know day seven we didn't have any food for that day. I kind of got in my head mixed up. Day seven I thought was the final day, but it should have like day eight officially should have been like the final weighing day, but I forgot. I don't know. When you film for a whole week for a video, days kind of get misconstrued. You don't really know what day it is anymore. I'm gonna go over everything the entire week, every single day, and then figure out the average calories um that we ate per day throughout this week and then just give my final thoughts on like everything like how like my mindset if anything changed did it, was i feeling better was i feeling worse like was my mindset better like all that kind of stuff but day one we had a total calories of 899 day two 817 day three 1062 day four 766 day five 1053 and then day six 789 calories averaging out to about 896.833333 repeated which is honestly pretty low for at the beginning of the video what did we do we did we did something where it said like we need to eat at least 2000 if you eat like 2000 calories a day as a male like you lose one pound a week or something like that which would make sense because this is almost half of that. It's a little bit more than half that and we lost about three pounds, which actually adds up perfectly to what it would say online. Um, our starting weight was 184 and then we ended at 181. So we lost three pounds in this week. Um, first off, I just want to say I'm not a health expert. I'm not a fucking weight loss. I, I don't I don't do this shit I just thought it would be an interesting video and I just was feeling like shit like after Christmas and New Year's and all that stuff So I was like I, this video will be perfect and I wanted to film it I was gonna do it regardless, but I was like, okay It might be interesting for you guys and maybe someone might want to lose weight and maybe follow what I'm doing Like I said, it was so shitty to like wake not was not shitty, but like just waking up in the morning was like uh, Like bruh like bruh like, I literally did not want to wake up. Um, it's, it's coming closer to the end, it was chill, bro. Waking up was nice. I was energized all the time. My creativity was at an all-time high. Um, before, one reason why I also wanted to start this was because, like, when I was editing videos, I was kind of just, like, going through the motions. And then, like, through this week, which is, like, cool, I literally started, like, the creativity started to, like, snap, bro, click again. 
um, I started getting really creative with editing and shit like that, and being able to work like long as fuck without like needing a break or anything, which was dope as hell, and that's what I wanted, and like that's what we got from this week, which is dope. Also, I just like felt better, you feel me? Like obviously, I, I haven't taken a shower today, I've just been editing this video, but like, uh, you just feel better, I don't know, like, when you eat shitty food, like, your face kind of feels, like, weighed down, like, your whole body kind of just feels, like, saggy, I don't know if that makes any sense, but, like, people will know what I'm talking about, like, if you know what I'm saying, like, if you know, you know, you feel me? I thought this was a fun video, I, if you guys like stuff like this, like, longer videos and, like, week challenges, month stuff, like, shit like that, let me know, because in 2020, I really want to change up the content, obviously, I'll do, like, my original stuff, but I don't want to post videos anymore just to post videos, like, I got into a habit in 2019 of literally just feeling the need to post a video just to post a video in 2020 i want this shit to be more quality i want it to be just like more enjoyable for you guys more entertaining more engaging for you guys just all around better content um so if you guys like this kind of stuff let me know down in the comment sections below obviously if i were to do this kind of stuff i wouldn't upload as much because it's like it takes longer the editing takes longer it is a more of a process but i think it turns out better so if you guys want that let me know down in the comment sections below if you guys enjoyed today's video leave a like on it if you guys are not subscribed to the channel yo i would appreciate it a lot if you guys go down hit that subscribe button literally punch it beat it flick it sock it in the face do whatever you have to do but hit that subscribe button i would appreciate it so 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 much but anyways that has been it for this week challenge it's honestly, it's been fun. I like doing this, um, and I hope to do more in the future. But as for now, I'm going to sign the fuck off and catch you guys in the next video.